if you are watching this video the day it goes live, the 11th of September, then congratulations! You are watching this video on my birthday! Woo! That was my birthday dance, I hope you enjoyed it. So this birthday I am turning 34. I'm not sure how I feel about turning 34. I mean, let's be honest, it's quite an adult age, and let's be even more honest, I haven't ticked off hardly any of the things on the bucket list of stuff to achieve by the time you've reached adulthood. No. 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 Oh, yes. Who am I kidding? I can't be classified as a grown-up. I mean, I'm dressed as a freaking TARDIS today. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, there are things that I do not like about getting older. Don't worry, I'm not about to sit here in my metaphorical armchair and be like, it was better in my day. But there are things I don't like about aging. I mean, wrinkles. Got myself quite a few of them now. I like to tell myself it's just because I smile so much. Every wrinkle tells a story. Grey hairs, I mean, every now and then I look in the mirror and it's like, oh my god, there's more! And bills. Bills? No. The freedom of being a kid and never having to pay for anything. <sighs> Man, I miss those days. Plus, I no longer have the energy I used to have. I'm dying, mate. I'm old. I get tired really quickly now, and don't even get me started on how many days it takes to recover from a night out. And there are loads of things I really miss about when I was young, specifically. Like TV shows. Guys, there were some brilliant TV shows back in my day. Certain bands from my youth. They have actually used the phrase, they call this music these days? And of course, I miss the freedom to throw the odd tantrum. It's just not socially acceptable to throw tantrums when you're an adult. I don't wanna go to work today! <laughs> not that I threw many tantrums when I was a kid. I was pretty well behaved. Now I've reached an age where I think, <sighs> My best tantruming years are behind me. But then again, despite the fact that there are many things I miss about my youth and there are things that really suck about getting older, being a sort of grown up isn't actually that bad. For a start, I'm finally confident in my own skin and believe me, that has taken a lifetime to get to this point. I can now look in a mirror and be okay with my reflection. Not like when I was a teenager and I would avoid mirrors at all costs because I hated my reflection so much. And I do like to think I have a little bit of maturity on my side now. Okay, mostly, mostly some maturity on my side. And the greatest thing about getting older is the independence it gives you. And wait, I know what you're thinking. Emma, you live at home. How much independence can you really have? But you're forgetting something. I have a car. Freedom! Yes, I can go anywhere I want to, anytime, depending on how much petrol is in the tank and whether or not I can afford to put more in. Okay, so, you know, freedom and the expenses that that brings. <laughs> but hey, being an adult means making your own decisions and being the person that you want to be without any pressure from anybody. When you're younger and you're at school and stuff, there's loads of pressure to be like, oh, you're not wearing the right outfit, oh, your hair's not right. Mm -hmm. When you're an adult, yeah, there's a heck of a lot of that, especially if you are female, but... If you can learn to like yourself the way you are, then there is a huge amount of freedom to be found from just going, do you know what? I think I'll be the person I want to be, thank you very much. And I have reached that age. Okay, it's taken me a long time, but I have reached that age, and I am happy to have that level of freedom in my life. So, 34 years of Emma, from baby to 
not so much of a baby. Here's to the next 34, eh? If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. And if you click subscribe as well, I might just send you some of my birthday cake, which I hopefully have. Wow, filming this ahead of my birthday is really strange. I mean, it's gonna go live on my birthday. What if I don't get a cake? What if I don't get any presents? Oh my gosh. Anyway, join me next Sunday when I am going to be participating in a challenge I have set to myself. I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet, but it's going to be really tough for me. So please join me next Sunday to find out how I get on. Until then, happy birthday to anybody else who has a birthday on September the 11th, and I will see you next week. <laughs>